Hello and welcome to this video initiative brought to you by AA Shah's IS Institute. Today we will discuss about the Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle. It will form an important topic in the Science and Technology syllabus. Science and Technology is an important part of Mains Paper 3 as well as for the prelims part of the examination. Let's get into the details about the PSLV. So the Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle or the PSLV has been developed by Indian Space Research Organization. It is the third generation launch vehicle in India. That means there were two more launch vehicles before this. It is aptly called the workhorse of ISRO because it has been consistently delivering satellites into low earth orbits. It was basically developed to launch Indian remote sensing satellites. But since then it has been used to launch various other satellites and it has catered to almost 209 satellites for customers from abroad as well. Now, although the name Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle suggests that it can launch satellites only into the polar orbits, but the PSLV can also launch small size satellites into geostationary orbits. It has also launched two spacecraft successfully. One is Chandrayaan-1, which was launched in 2008, and second is the Mangalyaan, which was launched in 2013. Now, let's see the details of the working of the Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle. So the first thing is that it is the first ever launch vehicle in India which has liquid stages. Now we have been reading this term quite a lot in the newspaper that it has four stages and it uses solid as well as liquid stages. So first let's try to understand what is the solid and liquid stage of a rocket. So basically what happens is that when a rocket is launched, it is launched with the help of multiple engines. If it is a multi-stage rocket, it is launched with the help of multiple engines. Now these multiple engines can use a solid propellant that is a solid fuel or a liquid propellant or a liquid fuel. So if it uses a solid propellant, it is known as the solid stage of the rocket and if it uses a liquid propellant, it is known as the liquid stage of the rocket. So the PSLV uses solid and liquid stages alternatively, which means the first stage is solid, the second is liquid, the third is again solid and the fourth stage is again liquid. Just to give you an idea, the, solid, the first stage is always at the bottom and it is the largest and then as we go up the, number, the numbering increases and the size of the engine keeps becoming smaller and smaller. Another thing about the PSLV is that it is an expendable rocket system. That means it cannot be reused. The parts of the PSLV cannot be recovered. Now following is the image of a PSLV that is quite often seen in the news as well. So I hope this video was helpful to you all. Thank you very much for watching.